Welcome in this video, or oh, welcome to this video. Uh, in this video, we shall look at examples on how to calculate the price index, simple price index, and the simple aggregate price index. So, our example of today reads the table below shows the prices of bread and meat per kilogram in 2000 and 2008. So, the table we are having item that is having beans and meat, and then year of which year is 2000 and 2008. And then the prices we have 700, 1200. 2500 4500 they are saying that using 2000 as the base year find the roman one the price relative of each commodity and then b is saying simple price index then c is saying simple aggregate price index so we start with the first part solution part a we are getting price relative. I said sometime it is called price index. You see, the same thing. So price relative, they have said of each commodity. We start with the beans and then we go to meat. But even before we start, you can record the formula for price index or price relative. Say that our price relative is given by P1 out of P0 times 100. That is our price relative. Where P1 is the price in the current year. Where where P1 is the price in the current year and P0 is the price in the base year. Base year. So we go to the first community. We shall start with commodity meat. I mean beans. That's our first commodity, beans. Then, price relative of beans, we say that price relative is given by P1 out of P0 times 100. So, our P1 of beans, they have said our base year is 2000. So, in plan 2008 will become our current year. So, our current year is 2008. So, we shall look for price of P1 from the column, from the row of beans that is going to constitute as our current price of beans. So, our P1 will eventually become the price of beans in 2008, which is 1,200 divided by our P0, which is the price of bean in the base year, which is of 2000, which is divided by 700 times 100. So the answer you get here, let me use my calculator. The answer you get 1200 divided by 700 and then it times 100. The answer we are getting is almost in 171.4 can put 4 to 86 you can even stop there or you can round off 171.4286 then the prices in the or the price relative or the price index of meat now that's where we shall go for or go to now the second one is meat and the meat we said price relative of meat is given by p1 which is the price in the new year which is now four thousand five hundred 
divide by price in the odd year which is 2500 times 100. So the answer we shall get here will give us our price relative of made 4500 divided by 2500. That is times 100 we get 180. This one become 180. So that one become our price relative of each commodity that is being made. made. So we have completed our first part, which is part one. Then for part B, for part B, they are saying, Part B, they are saying calculate the simple price index, simple price index, which is, we can call it SPI, but we know that simple price index is given by, is given by summation of P1 out of P0 times Z. 100 divided by N. But now we know that the whole of this one is the same as our price relative. It's the same as our price relative or price index. That one means that our simple price index is given by summation of price relative or price index divided by N, where we have said N is the number, now in this case it will be the number of price relatives or price index. So by doing that one, since we got our price index, if you still remember them, so we shall have our simple price index equals to 171.4 and then you continue there or you can leave it there 0 0.4 then plus 180 make sure you put all the decimal places which you put there 180 divided by how many numbers are we having of price relatives we have one two this one is it to become 180 divided by two so the answer we are getting become our price relative or price index if you add answer plus 171 this one was 171 let me put all of it 1712.86 plus 180, then divide by 2. 171 plus 0.4286 plus 180, answer divide by 2. We get 175.714. See, that's our simple price index. That's using that method. But if you want to use the first method, still, our simple price index will be given by the first method, our simple price index, which is simple price index, will be given by summation, which is the total of, we can call it the total, we are going to sum it, P1, our P1 of beans was 1,200 out of 700 times 100, then plus another summation of 1,000, 1,000, this one was 4,500 out of 2,500 times 100. Still here you can still get the same. Same divided by 
the number is 212. Still here, the answer you are going to get is 175.714. If you record to four the small places, so for the small places we get that one. If you record to one, get a different one. <clears throat> so we shall go to the last part, which is saying the simple aggregate price index. The last one which we are calling simple ag simple aggregate price index. This one is said you can call it simple aggregate price index or price relative. Uh, we say earlier on that our Simple price index is given by simple aggregate price index is given by getting the summation of prices in the current year divided by summation of prices in the base year times 100. This one gives us our simple aggregate price index so our summation is given by getting the total prices in the new year or current year which so prices in the current year we have 1200 plus 4500 that's the summation of prices in the current year it means that we are going to add all the prices in the current year then divide by the summation of prices in the base year and these are our prices in the base year so we are going to get their total that is 700 plus 2,500 for beans and meat respectively in 2,000 and then happy put for beans and meat in 2008 then we are, we are missing what we are calling times 100 so after multiplying after adding this one if you add this two which i have five thousand seven hundred divided by if you add this one you get six thousand two hundred times it one hundred so if you divide five thousand seven hundred plus i mean divided by six thousand two hundred the answer you multiply by 100, we shall get 178.125. So this one become our answer of simple aggregate price index. Please let us meet in the next video.